Oops. Dude, uh, so my dad is up to his old tricks, dude. Oh, yeah? Yeah. This is like maybe takes the cake of a like my dad returning things situation. I saw a picture you posted of him doing some kind of TV thing. Is that what you're talking about? <laughs> he was cast in a student film. Okay. I don't know if that counts, but like he teaches at Wesleyan and it's definitely like known for being an incubator for kind of creative people and filmmakers. And yeah. who knows? I was like, dad, watch this girl will become a big fucking star and then she'll cast you in a bunch of shit. Nice. So, all right. But my dad... Uh, bought a sandwich from Subway. Okay. And <laughs> he asked, so he, and he was intending on eating this sandwich for dinner. So he bought a sandwich and he asked for chipotle mayo. And instead of giving him chipotle mayo, they gave him chipotle sauce and regular mayonnaise. Mm. He opened the sandwich around dinner time and realized they had made a mistake. And he drove back to Subway and returned the sandwich seven hours later. I'm like, oh you can't, I'm like, you can't even do that. And he was pissed. He's like, they were giving me a hard time. I was like, they should be giving you a hard time. You shouldn't be allowed to do that, dude. It's Subway. That sandwich was eight dollars. Subway sucks anyway. Like, it's so bad. I don't know what you expect is going to happen there, but I can't believe that he they let him do that. Like, why does he think he can just walk around? fucking live in life as he pleases and break all the fucking rules okay not only that but what type of person <laughs> buys subway and then hangs on to it for seven hours dude i know those sandwiches have a shelf life of precisely five minutes <laughs> if you don't eat it the second they hand it over to you it's no longer edible i know dude i'm glad we're talking about this because I think Subway fucking sucks. It's disgusting. Like they take a piece of meat disgusting. that is that couldn't be thinner. This pe meat <sighs> is paper thin and they fold it in half to fool you into thinking like that sandwich, you could have a full turkey sandwich and I would still classify it as vegetarian Ugh. with how little meat they put Dude, on the, it. Dude, not only that, but once I heard that there were more Subways in the world than McDonald's, yeah, it's true. that's when I, I realized these people there is no quality control whatsoever totally and once upon a time seeing a subway was you oh oh look there's a subway let's go you know it was yeah. a, a relief um like a, a an a city on a hill alongside <laughs> the the jared campaign eat fresh you know healthy oh, yeah. somehow whatever and then sure enough their whole thing caught fire and went down the tubes not only uh, you know, the, the subway sandwiches taste like shit, but Jared himself was found out to be this rampant pedophile. Jared is an arch criminal. Dude, he is a, <laughs> like a, he's a horrible there's no person. exaggeration there. He had troves of child pornography and was, you know, a horrific dude. So and was manipulating children that he would find alone on the playground. Yeah. There's like, there's audio recordings of him talking about it. So, um, <laughs> subway sucks. Subway I, sucks. I don't know if I, it would, I, I don't see a scenario where I would ever stop to go to subway. If, because wherever there's a subway, there's probably a Wendy's or a Sabaro Right. Or something else nearby. And I don't like those places either, but I'm choosing them All 10 times out of 10 day, instead dude. of, you know, fucking what, what could only be described as like seagull bait. Dude, I, <laughs> dude, it's so bad. You're wondering if there are seagulls nearby, throw a Subway sandwich on the ground. Dude. And the thing too is like in the franchised ones where like one guy owns it. Like, they're so cheap, dude. Like, you're going to eat fucking stale bread. Yeah. Like, the subway in Union Station in New Haven is the worst subway easily yeah. in the fucking place. I mean, you shouldn't stale really be going to, to, to train station subways anyway. Yeah. Um, but, yeah. Yeah, I think getting food at a train station is always a It's not a necessarily yeah. ideal, but... Did Chris, you guys you see got? what happened in Ireland with Subway? No. What happened? Ireland, uh, in Ireland, they went to court and the judges ruled that Subway's bread could not be considered bread because there's too much sugar, sugar in, in it. it. I did see that. And that was wow. considered confection. Dude, wow. fuck, yeah, that's good. Yeah, you're just eating cake sandwiches. Good for good for Ireland. Good for Ireland, man. You know, those people really seem to have it figured out. Dude, so that is true, though, what you said. like <laughs> Apparently, they do have it figured out. But what you said is true about the Subway having the most, uh, there's more Subways than McDonald's. Yeah. And I think India uh, contributes to that. India. I know London. I remember going to London when I was younger and, and they were everywhere. 
And subway, I remember thinking, man. like, what? Why? It shouldn't be Subway Eat Fresh. It should be Subway Eat Cake. Yeah. <laughs> Apparently. Subway, you know, when you absolutely have no other option. <laughs> Guys, if you like this video, why don't you go check out some of our other videos? They're right there, right on the screen. We love you. We really appreciate it. Oops.